Hey everyone, um, so it's been a while and um, I have a collective haul for you guys. Um, I don't know if you've seen my Twitter like a couple of weeks ago, but I decided not to go forward with the 10 pan. Um, instead, I kind of shortened it down to a 5 pan and I kind of and I finished like you know the ones that I needed to before I went to purchasing more stuff. It just took way too long. Um, I think I started in October. And I didn't even like, I only finished, yeah, like just the five and the other ones, um, like the uh, Max Skin finish, like, I mean, there's no way I'm going to be able to finish that. I mean, at least I hit pans on the eyeshadows that I did want to do, like um, vanilla and shroom, which was fine. Um, and I'll continue to use them. But yeah, it's oh got to be way too long. So anyways, um, first I'm going to start off with <clears throat> my Forever 21 haul. And... Um, the first thing I got was this fedora hat. Let's try it on. But that's what it looks like. I love hats. I just don't get a chance to wear it often because I always forget <laughs> to bring it out. But yeah, I really like this one. Um, I kind of wanted like a lighter color too, um, but I didn't see one that I liked. Uh, so I'm going to wait until later. Maybe they'll have another one. Um, so yeah, I really like this one. Um, this was $9.80 for the hat. Um, I also got this cardigan. It's really, really cute. Um, and it's, yeah, it's just a plain cardigan. Very comfortable. And then I got this top here with the ruffles on the side. I really like it. It's really, um, cute and different. <clears throat> and then I got this one, which is just a regular top, um, except that the front has like a lace zipper. Very, um, it makes it casual, but yet you can still dress it up a little bit, but I like it. Uh, and then I got this really cute um, top here. It's this type of design. Um, it's a baby doll type look with um, a little lace in the front, which I really, really like. It's really cute. Um, and I got just this plain... Um, like stripe tank it did have a pin that goes with it but i took it off and i paired it with this green blazer i just added on here so it gives it a, like a nice accent look and i kind of i wore that underneath it so it really brings it out um, i love the green over black type look then this lace top i really like i'm not very much into lace but this top was very cute like the shoulders are lace um also the back and then on the bottom it's just cotton and i really like this um I like how that it looked this was only 1582 it's not bad and then i got this cute gray casual dress um that you could wear it's sort of like pinched on the side here and on the top here is like small pleats or something um but it's very i mean you can definitely wear it casual this one is an extra small uh since it's the love 21 brand so i'm usually a little bit smaller than that and this one's 2480 i really like it it looks simple um hanging but wearing it, it's really cute then this top is really cute too it's like i love the color and i love how it's like casual but yet there's like some frills um, to make it very dressy too and this is really cute I think this was also the Love 21 brand and this was 1980 now this cardigan was really I love this in the stores um, it's got chiffon like uh, material on the shoulders and then also on the frills on the front as well but yeah it's also very um, like sweater on the side too I love the accent I love the color uh, I can't wait to try this and wear this for spring possibly it might be a little bit hot for summer but we'll see but adorable see i'm not very much into butterflies but i saw this top and i couldn't help getting it after i tried it on it looked really cute very form-fitting actually um but this is the forever 21 collection it's got the ruffles on the top i really like the feminine detail and then it's got the butterflies um towards the bottom it's really cute very, it's a chiffon um, material. Oh, actually, it says silk material. This was $22.80, and um, which I was kind of surprised. Um, normally, if you see this at like um, Ann Taylor or like Banana Republic, it's at least like $40 maybe on sale or something. But I don't know. I like it. And then another cardigan 
top um, short sleeve and this one has the like bow on the side accent which is really really cute so I really like it and that's it for Forever 21 I didn't buy jewelry this time surprise surprise um, now moving on to makeup this has been like a long time coming I haven't really bought anything um, but at Walgreens they had a buy one get one 50% off so I've been hearing about the Maybelline Dream Matte Powder um, I have this in the cream light and it's really nice um, I do like the finish and it doesn't I mean when you put it on and no matter how much you put it on it doesn't look like it's caked it's very like smooth like um, and then I also got the um, Mineral Pow Power Concealer and this one is also the same color cream and um, I do like it it doesn't seem to be cakey uh, as long as you set it with powder and it should be fine then for MAC I did pick up um, the Viva Glam Cindy as well as the Gaga one. It's not the most wearable color, the Gaga, but I mean for a look if that's what you're going for. And I have been raving about the MAC Cream Sheen um, lip glosses. I've never ever tried it before, but for some reason I just I just um, ended up getting one and then I loved it so much that I went back and got two more. Um, and that is the the first one I got was Boy Bait. This is a gorgeous, gorgeous color. And it looks like I, I'm kind of used it a lot or something. But oh, I loved it. Love it. Um, it's like a nudie pinkish color. I really like it. It goes on very creamy, like not sticky at all. There's no sticky finish. And it kind of reminds me of NYX Whipped, which I also like too. The color might not be like that similar but I mean it's pretty close I would say and I would compare it to that um, I really do like it and the next one I got is Richard Lusher which is like a peachy I have it on my lips right now I really really like this it's such a pretty color as well as um, loud and lovely I wanted something bright for summer and that's the color on the top and then I wanted um, color me coral and then also um, I've been I've been looking for lollipop loving for the longest time and then finally um, makeup freak on YouTube Jerlyn she has it on her blog sale and I had to pick it up and it's such a really really pretty color and I'm so glad I got it thank you girl then the um, Liberty of London collection came to MAC. I, at first when I saw the collection, I wasn't really like all into it. And then also because it's like, you know, you don't get discount on that either. So I was very picky of like what I wanted to get. And then when I actually went there, um, I, I just got the lipsticks instead. And I really, really like the lipsticks. Um, the other ones, it just didn't really um, like, you know, I didn't really have any interest in it. The first one is Blooming Lovely. Um, a lot of people compared this to Lavender Whip. So if you missed out on that, this is another one that you should get then. And then this, another peachy or orangey type color. And this one is um, Ever Hip. And I really like this one too. Very cute. <clears throat> and then the next one is Peach Stock. I didn't think I wanted to get it, but then when I tried it on, I really liked it. It actually went on like a little... It's also like a peach color too. Uh, everything's peach to me now. <laughs> and I, that's it for my haul. I hope you guys enjoyed that. Um, let me know if there's any questions and I'll talk to you later. Bye!